All new on 7 Eyewitness News at 11. Some neighbors in Lancaster are worried for their safety. Here's why. They say one man recently purchased a plot of land here in the Trendwood Trail area and is using it to hunt. They're worried the area is too close for comfort. Here's 7 Eyewitness News reporter Jill Perkins. I didn't move to Lancaster and the Trentwood Trail to be hesitant and fearful uh, for multiple weeks out of the year when my kids want to play outside. And statistically speaking, uh, we don't want to be the first accident. Parents and residents of one neighborhood in the town of Lancaster packed the town hall tonight fighting to make sure no one can hunt near their backyards. We're talking probably a quarter mile down the road. You can go hunt. From, from our neighborhood. So we're just asking them to move just slightly so you're out of our backyard. The area in question is near Trentwood Trail, where residents say someone bought a small piece of property and is using it for bow hunting. The DEC currently requires crossbow hunters to be 250 feet away from a residential structure. Those using a longbow must be 150 feet away. The concern is really with our children playing back there. We're just concerned for safety, that's all. The town has now drafted a proposed law requiring hunters be at least 500 feet from a structure before discharging any weapon. The law would only apply to four residential zoning districts near Trentwood Trail, but some members of the community claim there's no need to make any changes. One reason, they say, in order for a bow hunter to kill game, they have to be very close to it. If I was wearing my brown car heart jacket in the woods and was walking through the woods before an archery were to even draw his bow back, he would know that I am a human and not a deer. I think the DEC knows more about what it should be than the town board, and I think we should stick with what they figured out from years of experience that that's how it should be. And at this point, it's unclear when the board will make a move on the matter. We'll keep you posted, though. Joe Perkins, 7A Witness News. Thank